Hello friends, today in this video we are going to discuss about the algal flagella and their different types. Okay, so flagella is a flagella is a tread like structure which which helps the cell in their movement. Okay, so their function is to move the cell from one area to other. Okay, so that is the main motto of flagella and this algal flagella found in all algae except rhodophyce that means red algae so except red algae in any other algae the flagella is present okay and this flagella algal flagella are two types first one is v plus or acronymatic and the second type is tinsel or pleuronematic and in another way we can say that the hairless flagella and hairy flagella so v plus or acronymatic flagella which possess smooth surface that means this type so here no filaments like this no filaments are present in laterally so they are hairless flagella or v plus or acronymatic the surface are smooth okay so that's why they are known as hairless flagella or v plus flagella or acronymatic flagella okay and the next is the tinsel or pleuronematic this type of flagella covered by fine filamentous appendages called the mastigonemes so the filaments which are present so which are present in two sides to opposite sides laterally these are known as mastigonemes these filaments which are present in laterally they are known as filaments are known as mastigonemes and which are present in tinsel or pleuronematic flagella okay and this pleuronematic flagella or tinsel are also known as hairy flagella because of this filaments because of this filaments okay and this tinsel or pleuronematic flagella is also divided into three types these three types and these three types are pan pantonematic pantochronematic and stichonematic so Pantonematic means mastigonemes or filaments arranged in two opposite rows or laterally like this. These filaments are arranged in two opposite direction laterally. Okay, and pantochronematic means they are also like pantochronem pantonematic, but at the tip of the at the top of the filament, one filament is present looking at the upwards. Here we can see that one flagella is present, one flagella filaments or mastigonym is present in upwards. Okay, but here no upwards filament is present or mastigonym is present. So that's why it is known as pantochronematic type of flagella. And last one is the stichonematic where the mastigonyms or filaments develop only one side of the flagellum. Here we can see that in only one side the flagella is present okay flagella filaments or mastigonemes are present okay so these are the main types of algal flagella and depending on the positions depending on the positions of the flagella depending on the position of the flagella in the cell the uh, flagella is or the algal flagella is also divided into another types okay so suppose if the cell running in upward direction here then this side is the front side and this side is the posterior side or back side so if the flagella is present in the top of the front side then we can we can say that this is the apical type of flagella okay and the subapical type where the where the flagella is dipped in the cell at the front side then we will say the subapical type of flagella and the lateral flagella whose flagella is present at the one side one side of the cell then we can say that it is a lateral type of flagella it is present in lateral way okay and if the and if the flagella is present in the posterior side or the back side then we can say this is a posterior type of flagella okay so in this way depending on the position 
of the flagella and depending on the mastigoniums or filaments we can divide the algal flagella in different ways okay thank you for watching this video